Hey y'all, how's it going? It's Dana from Growing Dreams Homestead. My family and I are homesteading on 10 acres in Indiana. I am in Indiana zone 6A, so we're in the east central part of the state. We are past our last frost date and our garden is in. I wanted to come with a short video to talk to you about an issue with my potatoes. So I have always been a huge supporter of mulching in your garden to help keep down weeds, to uh, maintain moisture, like there's so many benefits but I'm seeing an issue and I wanted to make sure I talked about it because I don't want anyone to um, see that I did this and they do it and then they have the same problem so I like to be transparent I want people to learn I want to learn um, and things happen and we learn as gardeners that when those things you know happen to us and then we share it so here we go I'm going to show you what I'm looking at all right so here is one potato bed and it was mulched with grass clippings from the lawn the majority of it and you see how green and full that is like you can't hardly see between the plants they are so full then as you come towards this side i had ran out of grass clippings and i put in some pine shavings and they are smaller and you can definitely see a difference there Okay, this bed is all mulched with pine shavings. Look how small they are. And they're also like getting yellow. So I'm gonna step back so you can see this kind of side by side. So there's, whew, I'm gonna fall over the sprayer, y'all. So healthy grass clippings, pine shavings. All right, so to be honest, I have never uh, really mulched my potatoes before because they usually take off so fast. We plant them on Good Friday and they get going and they are just like a huge just mound of, you know, potato foliage in the garden fairly quickly. But this year I was like, I'm going to go ahead and mulch them. I talked about using mulch in the garden in one of my gardening groups and uh, a gentleman had said don't use it on potatoes because he's had issues where it stunted their growth and yellowed them and at the time everything looked fine. I was like, Hmm, haven't had that problem yet well I'm trying I'm seeing it now so I'm gonna take a rake and go between my potato rows and rake off those pine shavings and I can reuse them in other beds because I have used them on tomatoes and peppers and things like that before with no issue um, but you know we like our potatoes and I plant it a lot and I'd like to get a big harvest I don't want to you know mess that up in any way so I just wanted to let you all know that because I would hate for other people to do the same thing and not realize that it could you know stunt your potatoes or harm them or make them grow slower or anything like we want to have successful big harvests in our gardens so yeah um, anyway that's my little spiel on potatoes I'm gonna get busy breaking that off um, might try to find some grass clippings to throw on there and see if we can get them caught up with the other guys. Um, hope you're having a good one. Thanks for hanging out with me. I'll see you soon. Bye.